Natasha Stonefire, and before you think it, the award is not for her lightning fast descent to the balls, but for the energy with which she attacks them. Oh. She's okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Apologizes to the balls for some reason and jumps. <laughs> so close, but so very, 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 very far. She was tired at the start, but at least she managed to get a few seconds of rest in before falling off. Window, so I thought I'm gonna at least get on one, but I don't want a boring exit. I want a quite a don't want a dramatic splash. Three. Well, Tony and Kelly had a dramatic plan from the outset. I'll be trying to do my somersault on the big, big red balls again. Hopefully, if I'm not covered in mud. <laughs> so let's see how the plan played out. Kelly's tactics for getting over the big red balls this time is that she's gonna backflip across them. show what happens when one small ball of energy hits a big ball of rubber. Two. Narrowly missing out on first place is Gary the Clown, who sets his goal, makes a leap, and hits exactly what he was aiming for. Well, the boy's actually, you can't deny that, it's just a show who shouted second ball <coughs> when she was actually finished that. I got the rare balls, but I'm all gonna say it was just oh, so much fun. It was so exciting. I got the rare balls, didn't land it, but I hit it. And it hit me back. <laughs> Winner! The best big balls wife has to go to gymnast and our first ever female champion, Queen Rachel. Rachel is fast, agile, sprightly, and hungry, maybe. Well done, Rachel. A lesson for everyone. If you want to win, you have to throw yourself into it. Face first. <laughs> I knew you made the world. I can't believe that.